The Miami Heat taking on the Phoenix Suns on a Tuesday night in the NBA. Chris Bosh, statistically one of the most clutch players in the league, would prove it on a Tuesday night early in the first quarter. Josh McRoberts to Bosh inside for the slam. He had 10 points in the first half. Later in the first quarter, Luol Dang gets the roll on that short pull-up jumper. He had 23 total points in the game. Miami would lead by five at that point. But the Suns got back into the game with some sharp shooting. Gerald Green knocking it down from deep in the final seconds of the first quarter. And Marcus Morris with the deep pull-up jumper as well. That would put Phoenix up 31 to 28. In the second quarter, Miles Plumley with the big block on Dwayne Wade. The ball came back and actually hit D Wade in the head. Probably doesn't love that, but we'll show it to you a couple more times. Phoenix up by five points at the half, but it was Chris Bosh heating up in the third, driving in for the layup over his defender. And this time Norris Cole looking for Bosh and he'll knock it down from deep. Bosh had 14 points in that third quarter, but it was a back and forth game late in the fourth quarter, especially Marcus Morris on the other end with the three. That would put Phoenix up by one. Now D Wade this time on the other end of the floor. He'll put in work and then fire a jumper. He'll get it to go plus the foul. Now he made that free throw, had 16 total points in the game. And on the other end, Markeith Morris finds his brother Marcus for the corner three. Marcus had a career high 25 points in the game. That would put Phoenix up by one. But Bosch would close this game out. Mick Roberts finds him for the jumper. And this time, D. Wade will. Bosch had a season high 34 points in the game, including seven straight down the stretch as Miami wins at 103 to 97.